everybody, Keith K here in the South Pacific with another Stranded Deep mini tutorial. Uh, in this uh, tutorial, we're going to quickly cover a little bit of farming for a specific case of the yucca tree. Um, so I've said before that uh, gathering um, the fibrous leaves is really important. It helps uh, with building and crafting and uh, fresh water supply. If you happen to be on an island that isn't spawning enough um, either yucca trees or fibrous plants, palm saplings I should say, that result in your fibrous leaves, um, this is a way to actually plant a yucca tree and then you have a steady supply. So the first thing you'll need to do is clear a yucca tree which will give you tons of fibrous leaves to start but then you're going to look for this green shoot right here it says yucca fruit so go ahead and grab that and then we're going to head over to a spot I've got picked out to plant a yucca tree um, so this gets into farming a little bit and in order to access the farming crafting menu you need a hoe so you really have to start off with uh, building your hoe in the main crafting menu and that requires a stone tool a stick and a lashing so we've got two rocks which will give us our stone tool here and then we've got a lashing and a no we've got two lashings but you'll see why we've got we'll need one lashing and a number of sticks to craft our hoe And then you're going to want to put your hoe, uh, sorry, equip your hoe. So if you don't do this, you won't be able to actually uh, craft the farm. Go back to your crafting menu, and it'll open up in farming because it knows that's where you are. And as long as you've got, uh, sorry, it knows that you have your the hoe in your hand. And then as long as you've got a lashing and four sticks, uh, you can create your farming plot. Now you can create a plank farming or a corrugated farming plot, and it might be more visually appealing to you depending on uh, your style. Uh, I don't like to waste th those resources. They're a lot more rare. Um, so I always go with the wood and then you just put it where you want and press uh, the mouse and it'll actually build it. And it's not entirely clear what it's looking for you to do at this point. Um, it looks like maybe it's not finished, but uh, you know, holding E or uh, holding the mouse won't do anything more to this and it's actually okay all you need is the plant you want to you want to plant in this case we're using the yucca plant hold e once you've got it equipped and you can see it's in there all right and then what that indicator is if you look it's a water drop and it's telling you that it's got one um you know one uh, fuel of water or one you know uh one of four um so 25 percent watered uh, and then what you're really going to need to do is uh, use your water still with your coconut flask or water bottle uh, later in the game. Um, and let's see if I've got any water in here. Yeah, it's got one serving. So you're just going to bring your water over and you'll see it says hold E to water and the indicator will increase to 50%. And that's pretty much it. And this will grow into a yucca tree that you can then harvest like any other yucca tree uh, and you'll get quite a bit of fibrous leaves that way. Uh, again, it may not be necessary. Uh, you may have plenty on your island, but if you did, uh, this would be a good way to get after it. So that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you find these useful, please like and subscribe and I appreciate everybody's support. See you back here soon.